No, she, she said you're fine now. I was like, I don't know, I don't worry. That's a fact. According to who? Would you be willing to take a drug test? <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. This is Bar- it's not Bar New Bar, friend. <laughs> I put my notes are wrong. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. This is The Bar Goyles, your favorite local podcast where we dive deep into the restaurant industry and the bar industry and try to uncover who are the allies and who are the adversaries to mm. the bar. Join us as we interview chefs, bartenders, servers, strippers, dancers. Those are different things. And then occasionally we like to throw a comic in the mix because all those people like to call The Bar home so please get ready for some candid conversations some behind the scenes reveals and just a whole lot of fun as we separate the bar enemies from the bar friends this is the bar goals ai wrote that (laughs) first time trying it ai wrote that ai has been we've been we've been trying to do the ai it's totally cool oh i thought i thought you were saying hey i wrote that (laughs) (laughs) no 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 it's the ignacio he's like hey no i didn't know that that. that. (laughs) no let's introduce the host before we introduce the guest here as always back in the coleslaw corner hey it's your boy Conte in the coleslaw corner you know i'm the out of four i'm the fifth you know fifth dentist Love to hate it, you know. And then over here in office, yeah, I couldn't find, I couldn't find. Me. <laughs> man, you had it, you had it. It was coming. I printed, I, I got it. Pull up the notes for yeah, you next time. Yeah, I got you. Don't worry, man. You had it, you had it. The fifth dentist. And then back in office. Man, you got your boy Corporate Nick, the manager you love to hate, but you know you need. That's Corporate Nick. He's over there. He's our corporate version. So on the show, we have our we have our people. We 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 all we met. He was serving. I was bartending, and then. When I first met you, you were still serving or were yeah, you I was still serving. I, yeah. yeah, I was still serving and then moving into management. Yeah, um, but when you first met me, yeah, I was still serving. Yeah. And then we all worked together, yeah. bartending, bartending, yeah. manager, and we're like, we need to have a manager on the show. We need manager energy on the show, and it's like been a good balance, been a lot of fun. But this is D Wayne White. I said that right, D Wayne. Dwayne. Yeah, Dwayne. Dwayne. Wayne White. Duh and Wayne. Duh, Wayne White. So, how, fellas, how did you guys meet this guy? Um, I'm. Oh, I, I go ahead. I met Dwayne through you go, coming to a, um, I don't know if it was a riff at the beginning or, hmm. I can't remember if it was a riff or when I went to go see Nick. Um, oh, D's, a, yeah. Yeah. Oh, um, yeah, 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 yeah. It was at a, um, at a show there, but definitely was at a show at um, Electric Palm where nice, Dwayne man. hosts. I think I, I met you first because I had found out about your mic. I hadn't actually showed up yet, but you came to the bar I was working at with your son. And oh, I did come. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, you had been there once because I was like, hey, I oh, know so, that Okay, okay. Been yeah. there. I was like, okay, hey, I'd already been dude. there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was a good fucking time. He invited yeah. me back and cool, t- cool stuff ever since. Here we are. I tell people all the time, you have the keys to Woodbridge and Northern Virginia comedy. And that's, I don't know if that's a mean thing, but that's what I've been telling people. No, no, I appreciate yeah, that. It's I, terrifying. I know, I know what you mean by Okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's terrifying. I mean, like, <laughs> you ever see the video of the guy in San Diego? Hey, I'm like a key holder in San Diego. You ever see that guy? No. Oh, oh man. Uh, pull, just pull up. Just type in <laughs> key holder San Diego. It, it's a content creator. Some I don't know kid. that holding the key in Woodbridge, Virginia is. Really <laughs> <laughs> it's more gangster than this guy. I promise you that. Yeah, um, something, though. No, it's, it's some content creator. Yeah. He's just walking around doing like man on the street shit. Uh, yeah. Go to videos. Um, and then some, some gangster just decides to check him. No, that's, that's not it. No. Okay. I'm back in. Oh, wait. No, that's it. Yeah. That's right. Not- yeah. Got to tap in. Yeah. This is hilarious, is what I think of when I say key holder. Oh, see, he did this again. Uh, no, geez. we can't be on prove it's it. the, the TikTok. Every time we go to TikTok, it's, uh, it's like, yo, fucking oh, prove you your go. human. You almost had it. There you go. Oh, that okay. puzzle. And then, then turn, go to the, the front, worst. turn the sound on. That is the worst, the puzzle ones. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's supposed to prove you're a human. Once, it, it once AI figures yeah. out crosswalks, we're all okay. Okay. <laughs> 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 It's a wrap. We don't just be letting people like walk around and just be recording. This guy's checking him because he's recording. Who do I ask for permission? Like, you can ask me, like, where you from? Okay, hold on. Let me redo it. Let me redo it. Let me redo it. Hey, um, I'm from Florida. Like, from Florida? yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Do you think I do you think I can film here? Yeah, I'm from Dago, so I'm I'm like one of the key holders. You know what I mean? I'll give you a little. One of the key holders. Like, what do you mean? Like, what, what is your content about? Oh, what like we're just trying about? to like yeah. basically what? exactly. Get people's information. That's that's the whole thing. Anytime I like, I'm one of the key. Holders. I'm one of the I'm one of the key holders. Uh, I'm out here in Dago. A uh, Dago, Dago. 
That's what they say. Ain't nothing gangster about San Diego. <laughs> what? Yo, what? You're so know, rich. Yo, yo so San Diego rich. Pirates, dog. My sister <laughs> graduated from that high school. They're, I'm out here in the streets know. in 75-degree weather. <laughs> right. Yeah. yeah, the streets is tough. It's breezy. Tough out here. Breezy it's as hell, though. Yeah. <laughs> right off the top. It's, it's hard being as close the to the poverty line is $105,000 a year. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> you, see, you see hot homeless it's people. Like it's annoying. Yeah, dude. Right. You're like, that guy's asking for money, and he's pulling better bitches than me. Like, this is that. Why is this? Homeless guy jogging. <laughs> this is this is right. He's Homeless, got abs. Homeless, Homeless guy is cardio. a Yorkie. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <that's great. laughs> Vato cardio, man. Vato cardio. A homeless Yorkie. Yeah. That is the worst homeless dog. Yeah. That's <laughs> fucked up. Fuck? Well, luckily, luckily, you know, someone would eat that, and and that's somebody had to make the joke today. I swear to God, like it was. They're eating cats and they're eating dogs. They're eating cats and dogs. Immigrants are eating cats and dogs. Is that what was covered in the debate last night? I didn't. I didn't watch. Are you serious? The no, I didn't watch it. The man yeah. said that. He out said loud. it out oh, loud. No. Illegal immigrants are eating cats and dogs oh, no. now. In Ohio. In Ohio. My people are not in Ohio. They have cows in Ohio. You can just go get a cow. Right. Like you can just go, go do that. And take your dog. Go do that. Man. There's Certainly. usually no one around. The cows. That's. <laughs> Okay, shout out Donnie. <laughs> shout out, shout out yeah. future president. He also, he lost said, it. He also said, I saw two things. I saw, I saw one. I stepped out into the bar last night. I saw the second thing I saw him say was that uh, Kamala Harris wanted to perform operations, sex change operations on people current illegal immigrants currently in. Prison, or I don't. It was like it was okay. like there was a lot of details. Okay, like, yeah. I don't remember. It was like, what the I fuck? love I love a good hillbilly conspiracy theory. Dude, like, really? Yeah. Oh my god, oh, man. dude. My, um, I remember being Let's at the go. bar during uh, post COVID. I had a guy come up to me. He goes, "You got one of them one of them cell phones?" I was like, "Yeah, I got a cell phone." He goes, "Was it one of them five Gs?" I was like, "Yeah." He goes, "Yeah, five Gs. What they're gonna do is they're gonna turn the towers on, and the five Gs gonna connect to inside the the micro exactly electrons inside about. of you. And what, what it's gonna do is it's gonna activate inside you, and then you will." government clone you a government drone they gonna control you from the 5g towers and then they're gonna make you turn your phones in and make you turn your your guns in that's what's gonna happen oh, like, <laughs> all of that for guns like all of that for guns oh all right damn Damn. Yeah, I remember Man, that guy. That his, his whole in. face just popped in my head. So I, know, yeah. I know exactly who you're talking about mm. who said that. Because I would walk by him like, what the fuck is this guy talking about? Was that about? at the electric bomb? <laughs> <laughs> no, he might have frequented you, there, he, though. He was downstairs. One of those, yeah, yeah, he's one of the downstairs guys. Yeah. He was there for Cowboy Night well, last Friday. Yeah. <laughs> Great time. So let's introduce Cowboy Dwayne Nights. to some of our guests here. The, the regulars at home, you may not be familiar with Dwayne White. Produ- or is Dwayne White Comedy Productions? What is it exactly? Uh, so they can follow it's D-Dub Entertainment, but actually, but it's Dwayne White Comedy. DwayneWhiteComedy.com and any socials you want to plug right now, just your IG, your Facebook. Yeah, Instagram is White Dwayne Comedy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> any any form of White and Dwayne, you can find me. Uh, but yeah, Instagram is White Dwayne Comedy. That's the main one uh, where everything's at. And then the website, I either you can either go to Dwayne White Comedy or White Dwayne Comedy. I, I did that just you got both. Yeah, I did. Yeah. I, no, it was it was you got a joke two domain name money, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I got an extra fifteen bucks. Bro. <laughs> that's yeah. fifteen a year. That's, that's fifteen good. a year. Yeah, so true, you know, so, that's you know. another tax bracket. If you're <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Actually, yeah. It's more business expenses, the better. Man. More write offs. Write right that off. Yeah. Yeah. Um, no, that's yeah, right. man. Shevitz made a joke. My friend Shevitz. Yeah. Yeah. Has he been on here yet? You know? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. People know, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, Shevitz got beef with Decante every time he sees Decante. He checks him. For what? What does he got beef with you? I called him an enemy. Oh, the bar enemy. Oh, snap. It, well, it took yeah, Shevitz yeah. two episodes to find out what Fifth Dentist was. And then once he found it out, he, we stopped the entire... He's like, yo, fit, you don't agree with motherfuckers. That's what you do. Because you, you the dentist. Yo, son. <laughs> I was like, yeah, man. You know, I know you're missing yeah, some teeth, but like, that's a dentist thing. Like, you didn't get it. And <laughs> ended up calling him an enemy because it was... Uh, he said that... Oh, the, yeah, he, he parks in front of the ABC store and not in the parking lot. Oh, they, yeah. Give away our best that would, question. That would that piss me off, too. <laughs> 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 I feel more confident about my friend or foe. <laughs> <laughs> right that is good. Yeah, no, that one gets us. The people who just pull up and hop out. I'm like, that's a fire lane, man. Like, <laughs> yeah, you know, now, yeah. I will do that. I will do that at the UPS store to drop off Amazon shit. I don't oh, know man. what that yeah, means. Yeah, no. like, fuck those guys. <laughs> so, <laughs> someone's bad. got merch. They're sending internationally. You know, <laughs> yeah. damn, must be nice. Right, yeah. That's an extra $50 a year money. That's me sending back all the bullshit that I bought. Okay. 
okay. That's what yeah, that yeah. is. I do a That's lot of returns. <laughs> uh, when, when we were like really aggressive with our merch, people would buy it, and I'm like, all right, uh, I'm, on, I'm at bungalows on Mondays and Tuesdays and Fridays. Come pick it up. They're like, what? I was like, you live in Woodridge. Come pick it up. I'm not fucking sending. I'm not spending fifteen dollars to send you a package down the street. They're like. Well, maybe yeah. I don't want it no more. I was like, go fuck yourself. I'll drive to your house. Yeah, well, I like drive to people's right. house to drop off merch. Just throwing it like a paper boy. Like, <laughs> yeah. Get a t-shirt cannon. Just like, oh, I would love to have a t-shirt on, cannon. Oh, how have much is that? Hey, look, hey, can you look at <laughs> Look at how much a t-shirt cannon is. Let's get a t-shirt cannon <laughs> right now. <laughs> and while he looks it up, can you give a little rundown of just your like comedy? Like We know you as a comedian. So yeah. like, when did you come to this area and start establishing the rooms and, and what you're doing right now? Uh, well, what I'm doing right now, let's see. Because um, I know you got Monday nights and Tuesday nights. Tuesday, no, no, wait, Tuesday, Tuesdays Wednesday. and Wednesdays, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, days are irrelevant. It's, uh, it's fine. But no, um, let's see. When I started, I started here. Mm. I started running the shows that we run. Uh, we just started an open mic at the, at the spot. And uh, did I just lose myself? Okay, sorry. I, just, uh, I couldn't, no, 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 no. I couldn't <laughs> hear myself. I'm sorry. I was like, what's happening? Um, yeah. That's good. Uh, no, we started it in right after the pandemic started. It was, uh, it was what, 2021, early, like February 2nd. I remember it was Groundhog Day. Groundhog Day 2021 was, was the first night we were at the Electric Palm. And yeah, we just been there doing that. We started with an open mic, and then they asked. So us what to happened? Do were you up. just like looking for rooms? And you yeah. Just like, well, you know what? You know, start my own. <laughs> I had we had a room yeah. for a while um, at another place that is no longer in business, and I'm very happy because the dude that ran it was an ass. Um, <laughs> you worked there then. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. That place talking about? I mean, yeah. yeah. You were there for a while. Right? I, yeah, I was there for a while. I wasn't there when they did any comedy. Yeah. I was gone by the time they started. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it was yeah, bad. Yeah. I was, was gone bad, by the time. Oh, that's gonna be a good story for the pod, actually. It was, yeah. a, it was a bad, it was a very bad uh, mm. situation. The dude was not good. But uh, but then, yeah, we did that for a couple months, kind of worked out the kinks, and then, uh, you know, he shut down, so we were looking for a new spot, and we found the Palm. And they, Palm was a blessing of a spot. Yeah, yeah. dude, yeah. it's been great. It's been, we've been there, you know, like I said, now for three and a half years, and it has been, it's, it's been great. You know, it just gets better and better, and, the, the you know, love the staff, love everybody there, and, the, and you know, they take care of us, and. Yeah, they're great for it's events. We, awesome. we we before yeah, the iteration, the these guys were on the show here. Yeah, we did a Christmas show there. Did like a two out, two and a half hour Christmas show. Yeah, yeah. You know, he was letting us fucking. We we're shotgunning beers. We we're throwing beers into the crowd. Like it was a, it was yeah. raunchy as hell. Like he probably shouldn't have let us do that, but we had a great fucking time. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so then you started the mic. Yeah, I mean, you took over the scene. You got the Monday, yeah. the Tuesdays and Wednesdays, and well, then I'll tell you what. Here's why it was good at yeah. first because when we first started, everything else was still shut down. Like like. Uh, D.C. was shut down. You couldn't do any comedy up in D.C. Yeah. They tried it. People called the health department on people and stuff Man. like that. Uh, there was some stuff up in Maryland. But so it was great because that's how everybody came, started coming down to the Palm. And, like, nobody would have come down here if, if, you know, we hadn't started it at that time. It was perfect. It was, it was just good. Hey, man, you know, we got people from, like, right Charlottesville coming out. That, uh, that, that Roanoke. Fucking, yeah, from Ro- yeah, the kid from uh, Roanoke, Roanoke with the accent. I was like, uh, Ro- damn, hell yeah, man. Roanoke, oh, that's a trip. Dude, yeah, yeah. It's been crazy. Yeah, we've had people from all over the place come yeah. through. So, yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's pretty cool. Well, that's something these guys have. I've been trying to like press on them to understand is that like we've been having a lot of servers and bartenders on the show and like they don't give a fuck about this. They're they're doing us a favor, quote unquote, when they do it. And then we've been having a lot more comics. And I, t- I explained to them Ace. I was like, yeah, Ace drove out here from Gainesville to do this show. And they're like, well, it's because we'll fuck? drive four hours to do five minutes. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, 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 exactly. That's exactly what I said. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I'm like, I'm offering you an hour. Ago, a couple yeah. years ago, I was flying to Connecticut like yeah. twice a month to do, to do contests. I was yeah. like, I'll fly to Connecticut, get a hotel, rent a car to get no money. It was great. That's yeah. comedy, baby. Yeah. Let's yeah. go. Yeah. Yeah. We're, we're, just, we're like, oh, we got time? We can do some time? Yeah, okay, yeah. yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know a place that I can go up? I can go, yeah, all right, yeah, I'll go. Is it Virginia yeah. Beach tonight? I'll go. Yeah, I'll go. Yeah, why not? Fucking A, we're addicted. <laughs> Terrible. I got a very economical car. Let's get on the <laughs> right. Great on gas. Oh yeah, yeah. Great on gas. I no, just outside. <laughs> yeah, okay, that's that that's one. the yeah. local drive. Oh, <laughs> that's local drive. Yeah, okay. They can't be the one they're no, no. talking about. They're, they're, they're making fun of my F one fifty. That's part of it. Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> for comedy, yeah. for com- my, the comedy car is a little Kia Soul. It's super good. Oh nice. <laughs> so you talking about the hamster? Wait, car. that's the hamster. Yeah, that's yeah, the hamster. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's got my big old Instagram across the back, like I'm selling. That's stuff a that's a work vehicle. That makes it work. Absolutely, that makes it a work vehicle. The business bought it last year, dude. That's what I'm saying. That's what Why can't I put bar goals on my car? <laughs> but let me tell you something. Uh, 19 miles a gallon versus 35 is a big issue. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I lose up what I lose in cool points. He <laughs> <laughs> gave back in the tank. I'm going to laugh my ass to the bank with all this money I'm saving. <laughs> that's right. That's why I can have two domains. There you go. <laughs> Two domain money, baby. Two domain <laughs> money. <laughs> D Dwayne with the two domains. You don't know you about got this. That yeah. D Dub. D Dub. That's what the D D stands for, actually. That's it. Ye
Okay, fucking taking over the comedy scene. Uh, that's how I met you. Trying to go, trying to circle back. Trying to circle, you know, how it is. We got, okay. on the rails. On the rail, a little bit on the rails. Speaking of rails, uh, to con- okay. you haven't been going to that bar, have you? No, nah, I've been going the past uh, three days. We got yeah. some tales from the rails. You got anything? Uh, nah, just the usual. Just the usual. Peter, Ashley Kirk. Can you, can you explain to people? the guests oh. what the tales from the rails is? And yeah. The so home? for for those uh for our guests that watch and our regulars. Uh, Tales from the Rails is my adventures at the bar, uh, tap room or down under for the local area. Yeah, that one yeah. shitty bar. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you ever go there, tap room? No, oh, yeah. I don't even it's know where it's at. It's a small little dive bar, like what, like two, yeah. ten feet from. It's Madigan. a basement smaller oh, okay, than okay. this. Okay. You know where Doracos is? Oh yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. I know what you're talking yeah. about. Now. Yeah. So uh, every time, every night, right at like one thirty, Ashley starts going off the rails. Ashley's somebody, old manager used to work there. Uh, and she'd go off you the rails. Said, she doesn't work there. Anymore? Yeah, she don't work oh, there. Oh, she's not there no more. No. Oh, last time. Oh, I, I heard was they there. fired everybody. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. And uh, yeah, she'll just start kirking off hey, on Jim. people. And it's like, yo, get the fuck out! Uh, like, just going off the rails, banning people. How you gonna ban somebody? You don't even work there. She, no I was gonna ask. She doesn't like, work there, but she's banning people. Is she, is she banning people? You bro. can't. Come, you can't come to my bar no more. <laughs> fuck you. I was like, what the fuck are you she sounds me? fun. Yeah, yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm telling you. Oh, she loved. Yeah, she uh, loved it. She loved I, we knew she loved Decante because one time she was kicking everybody out, and we're like, "All right, cool." She's like, "Y'all with Decante, you're good." Hey, get the fuck out! <laughs> Hell, y'all get the fuck out! You guys are good. You guys. Are, I was like, I don't even I was like, be this good. This is the shittiest bar I want to <laughs> yeah. be good at. I don't, don't want to be good at this here. bar. Like, let me be good somewhere else. Can I be bad? Throw me out! Please throw me out. Call your friends. Throw me out. I want to leave so bad. So crazy. So no bad stories of late. Just the. You're a regular oh, there now. Yeah. So, yeah. so okay. No, no one's shitting out front again. Yeah. <laughs> no, no. Shitting out okay. No hate like crimes. Yeah. Nothing like yeah. that. Yeah. There's no uh, hate crimes in Akakuan. <laughs> bullshit. Yeah. That's right. Bullshit. <laughs> uh, so it was uh, Monday night. Uh, came out, had some drinks at Bungalows. I ended up, meet, ended up meeting uh, one of my regulars, Steven, mm-hmm. there, and he had some friends just come in from Florida. Uh, they wanted to go to some new local scene, so I took him out to Tap Room. Uh, Cool, and we're having a good time. We're having some drinks. Steven's like blacking out, or excuse me, time traveling. And like, like shout and out I, to Steven. <laughs> shout out to Steven. Yeah. <laughs> shout out to Steven. Yeah. Shout out to the time travel. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And uh, we're about to head out, and I'm talking to the guys, and like these two girls start going at it. And I mean, like, this chick grabs her by her hair, and it's just Molly Whopper. Oh, Mind shit. you, it sounds like hey, Sophie. Hey, the smaller one is beating on the bigger one. Like I'm talking. Of course. Like, oh yeah. That's that's right. Right. Yeah. yeah. That is not. Nice. Nice. Small <laughs> girls know how to fight way more than bigger. Oh yeah. yeah tall girls. They don't give a shit. They're just gonna grab your hair and fucking yeah. knee you. Low center of gravity. Yeah. yeah. The tall yeah. girl doesn't know how to use their distance. You know yeah. what I mean? They're, They're used to people point. being nice to them. Small girls are like, I will fuck you. She's too much on that back foot. I'm telling you. And man. And then so they're, they're trying to break a fight. I'm trying to get up out of here because these guys are, my, my crew's hammered. You I'm saw two girls out. fighting and you wanted to leave? Well, it was already, I'm trying to get out. I actually yelling at me. Okay, <laughs> okay time out. These were not hot girls. Then. No, no, no. Okay, they yeah, were. that's fair. Uh, yeah. Right. See, if they were hot girls, he would have been like, nah, fuck. Yeah, I'm he would have been like, oh, shit, wait for a ticket to pop out. Star. Yeah. World star. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, and the, one, the, the guys that worked there, they were like, yo, man, come on, do you? I need you tonight. And I was like. Nah, I'm like I gotta go. <laughs> I need, you. I gotta need go. you for what? You abandoned the homie. Ho- yeah, I abandoned wow. them. Wow, they had it already. Yeah, it was already done with by the mm. time that. But yeah, I ended up leaving. I was like, I felt bad, but mm. yeah. what was the fight about? Do you remember? Did you hear? No, I'm just I'm talking to the people right here, my my peoples, and then the next thing I know, I just see boop 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 boop, get somebody get pieced up. Wait for that uppercut. It doesn't surprise yeah. me at all. Every punch is an uppercut for the short bitch. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. Gotta do what you gotta do. Punch out. That mm-hmm. one's wild. Dude, that's awesome. Oh, okay. So. You don't see girls fight enough. It, yeah, you don't. You don't. Know, no, because they never fight. It's just <laughs> yeah. grabbing and shit. Yeah, well, but dudes, come on, man. We just they talk shit the whole time. Yeah. Like, we just like, you well, no, first punch. Well, no, Dekante just talks shit to a girl, and then they hit me is what happens. I can yeah. see that. I can yeah. see that. No, that happens. Yeah. <laughs> no, it did happen. <laughs> it happened in real life. It happened in real, yeah. yeah. real life. You yeah. talk shit, and they hit him? And yes. they hit him. Yeah. Yeah. Here's the thing. I was standing on the street. He was standing on the curb, so... Oh, he's already got like six inches on me, uh, top and bottom. And so, like, now he's on the curb. (laughs) Now he's on the curb. So, he's looking like six, eight on the curb. I'm down here. He was talking a bunch of shit to a lady um, because she was just being, you know, a a stripper in New Orleans. And she looks at him. She's like, fuck you. He's like, you ain't going to do shit. She's like, I don't know the fuck you're talking. And then she hits me. I'm not paying attention. She winds up hitting me. And then some other lady's like, 
how dare you hit that guy? And she saw her, she beat that girl's ass for me. Yeah, it was yeah. the nicest thing that ever happened. It's 47 seconds. Um, if I, if, yeah, this happened literally in New Orleans, like not even a month ago. Go down. That's awesome. Down, yeah. I yeah. had the video of Win- the other girl who beat her ass yeah. was dressed as Winnie the Pooh. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is, that's, that's, Winnie the Pooh. One that's, that's, a, that's the most New Orleans story I've ever heard. <laughs> oh, yeah. like. And then this bitch beat up a stripper. She <laughs> yeah. was dressed like Winnie the Pooh. Uh, uh, 41 yeah, right there. I didn't 41. say shit. Yeah. But well, she the stripper was yeah. beating up a homeless person before yeah. we yeah, got there. Before so we got there. Twice. Oh, yeah? yeah. yeah. So, oh, which is not good. Yeah. The one on the left is the one who who hit me because DeConte was talking shit, which I, I understand. She looked at DeConte. Where and then, were you guys hanging out in New Orleans, man? <laughs> French Quarter. Bourbon, Bourbon Street. Street. Yeah, Bourbon, Street. Bourbon Street. At, know, three, at almost four in the morning. Okay. Bourbon Street yeah. at 3.53 a.m. Y'all need to go to bed early. Walking home. We're on vacation, man. The ghosts in New Orleans go to sleep earlier than that shit. The one on the left hit me. Me. Like, that on that we need the poo. I was like, hit it for me. Oh, for me. Please. <laughs> Keep bringing up. Are these both <laughs> prostitutes? Get her! Uh, strip, it was right strip, sex yeah, workers. Yeah. I'm sorry. Sex workers. Yeah, they're they're give her the Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> Who said? <laughs> <laughs> He's just giving good commentary, you know. <laughs> <laughs> The context. Which, <laughs> which was like 10 years old now. No one yeah, no knows. Like that's like 20 years yeah. old, bro. Like, are you kidding me? Uh, Winnie the Pooh won. She's on top. And then... Took a loss. Yeah. Now they just rolling around. That's yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah, that, that happens. So. Yeah, yeah, DeConte is the guy who will talk shit. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for stopping on the chick with gross li- ties, too. I appreciate you. $1,200 for a t-shirt cannon? Yeah, that's insane. That's yeah, nuts. go to AliExpress. Yeah. It's only 300 yeah. Oh, I love Ali. Uh, Ali Four Express, months later. Yeah. I just need it. I just need it. We need some rubber bands and bad attitude. That's all we need, dude. We'll make that Bam, work. Bam! fucking shoot but that. the Bart Simpson yeah, out yeah, this dude. motherfucker. That's right, dude. Man. People will do crazy shit for a free t-shirt. That's oh what's my God. amazing. <laughs> People will kill their parents. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Fucking Menendez free brothers. Free t-shirt. I, was, I don't know where I got this shirt from, bro. It was like a... I was at the stadium. I, I hit an old woman for it. <laughs> yeah, knock, you didn't have to do that. old lady. Yeah. Well, you it's a $5 one. shirt, bro. Yeah. Yeah. It's a $5 I saw shirt. People, I was at the minor league baseball it. game mm-hmm. like last week, and I thought somebody was going to choke somebody out for a T-shirt for the Fredericksburg Nationals. <laughs> for the Fred Nets. Like, Fred Nets. Oh, Fred Nets. And the thing is, the shirt never fits you because it's just a random shirt. Oh, yeah. Well, no. You're like, no, I'm kind of a large It's always a 3X. It's always, you know, 2X, 3X. There's no such thing as a one-size-fits-all shirt. It'll fit. You. Yeah, yeah. but there, there's something about a dirty, trashy white girl who like ties it up in the back a little oh, bit, like yeah. who can turn any XL shirt into like a crop top. I'm yeah. always like, I can save you. I can save you. My <laughs> wife sometimes takes them and sews them. She like cuts this oh, shit wow. out and makes them oh. women's cuts. I'm like, all right, you know, you can just buy them that way. <laughs> you don't need to do put in the labor. Yeah, dude, you know, you know <laughs> turn our house into a sweatshop. Yeah. I know. It's like, and you're never gonna finish it. You cut it, and then you whatever. It's, it's always going to be fucked up. You wear it once, maybe. <laughs> so before we go into part two, in part two, we do bar, a new bar friend. Oh, boy. We, we have someone special on here who comes from very, very uh, different worlds. And the only reason we want to bring up, quote unquote, your, not quote unquote, your military experience was okay. we had an issue with last week where at Conte, we were talking about like people having sex with dirty, disgusting women and someone, uh, I think Nick or I threw out like, oh yeah, you no, know, fucking some guy in the army will fuck her. And he's like, no man. That's a Marine thing. There you go. Yeah, he, but Dakota was like, our armed forces wouldn't do that. He's like, no, oh, no, yeah, no. They they're, uh, he's like, they're <laughs> upstate. <laughs> he's like, yeah, they're he, like he, held, he holds the armed forces in such high regard. Joe will yeah. fuck you over, man. Let me tell you something. <laughs> I, hey, no, Joe. Hey, I, Joe. I was, I was a soldier and I was an officer. And let me tell you something. Me, I found, this is how gross soldiers are. I found out the night before I left Iraq that my my platoon in Iraq in 03 had been sharing a pocket pussy. <laughs> Yo. I would, I would oh, like to remind no. you and the listeners, we did not have running water. Yeah, you, you got to boil okay. it. Yeah, yeah. You gotta, I don't know how you got to, like, I don't know how many baby wipes <laughs> yeah. makes it okay, but, like, one more. You got to put it in a shaker. Yeah, right, that's cool. insane, dude. Put it in that blue shit that the barbers have. You know oh, what I mean? Yeah. 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 One of the supersonics. Yeah, so oh. let's not hold, don't hold soldiers in too high. Right <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, don't, I don't know why. When it comes to their so dicks naive. and their liver, there is no limit. <laughs> Hey, no, no car. Car. Yeah. <laughs> now they'll go to classes where they say don't do that yeah. but you know whatever. <laughs> yeah. so we we have some questions here for you this is outside of bar new bar friend where okay. we have the it's the armed forces versus the unarmed comedians we're going to ask you some questions Jeez. you're going to tell us whether or not you'd rather be with a comedian for this or someone from you know the, the forces are served go to the notepads there you go uh i'm going to ask the first one who has a more of an alcohol problem comics 
versus or the you know comics versus ooh armed forces. ooh I would say I would say armed forces mm-hmm. I would say armed forces um, alcohol comics or drugs. That's what I'm saying. Because uh, <laughs> the armed forces folks can't do the drugs <laughs> legally. Yeah, yeah. They can't legally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do them. Legal, Some yeah. of them do, but no. I can, but but when it's time to go, it's like let's freaking get oh, it up. Comics are in bars working. Like the good ones are working, so they're yeah. not pissed. You know, they're not yeah. getting too hammered drunk. But uh, you know, I'm saying, but uh, <laughs> yeah. okay. sometimes we have to. But you know. <laughs> I have been known. Never mind. Um, <laughs> I've been really good for a long time. Mm. Ever All since, right. ever since the the bad fiasco that was the roast of me years ago. Oh, but, you uh, got a roast? Oh, yeah, it was bad. I don't was remember. Recorded? Any of it. Is it anywhere? Uh, there's pieces of it. We'll but find it. No, we'll find it. Here's the link. Uh, yeah, yeah, it we'll is. It. it is rough. <laughs> I got. I got really hammered. I don't remember any of it. And by the time it was my you? turn, yeah, yeah, it was our year anniversary at the Palm, and so uh, so they did this roast and, uh, <laughs> buddy. Yeah. Yeah. I Bring said, on the margaritas. <laughs> I was doing Tito's and soda and straight Tito's and Ooh. Tito's and cranberry and shots of Tito's. Hey, and it's going in. It's so, well, I was by so myself at the table. I couldn't talk to anybody. Like, was, they had me at a table oh, by myself. Oh, the dance. Uh, yeah, you're on the dance floor. And I was like, oh, yeah. all I was doing was hammering. Drink. At one point, I think. At one point, I think I tried to snort somebody's grandfather because they brought him in his ashes in. It was. It was I don't know if you knew Austin. Never mind. Um, <laughs> Shout out Austin, shout yeah, out Grandpa. Shout out, yeah, shout out different ashes. times. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, he brought an urn and put it up my table. I'm like, Jesus. I'm going to snort this. I'm like, I, don't, I don't think I did. I think yeah. my wife would have stopped me. But it was like, well, <laughs> For legal purposes, he obviously didn't. Alleg- also, no, I didn't allegedly, these are characters we're playing. Yeah, this episode is sponsored by the local crematorium. Yeah. <laughs> if you want to burn it, we'll earn it. Hey. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Um, who, between the two, who's quicker on their feet? Oh, man, that's actually tough. When, what do you mean when you say quicker on their feet? Uh, like one in a person, fight or one in person, an argument? I mean, one doesn't really get into too many fights, I'd like to think. You know, comics, I don't think they're, f- like, actually physically fighting. Oh, yeah, but, no, yeah, no. Like, no. transitioning, you know, pivoting out of a bad bomb versus, you know, something going wrong. Oh, comics, things. man. Yeah. Comics are better at that, for mm-hmm. sure. You, yeah, because we're used to it. You're, like, it... You, People aren't in the military aren't used to like failing and shit. True. Like, oh, like, oh, okay, yeah. You, you uh, work hard so you don't fuck it up. Practice then, so much you never get it wrong. And us, we have yeah. to take the shit in front of people night. and go, nope, never nope. say that in public right. again. Yeah. <laughs> Good with that one. Yeah. But, but I mean, you, we, think you can hurt my feelings. But I will say, what I will say is, there are people in the military though that are that are quick. Like, dude, get a drill sergeant. A drill sergeant is a stand up comedian, man. Mm. Do, <laughs> they mm. tell some jokes and they see things happen and yeah. make it hilarious. Very quick. Right. Like I've never laughed harder. My dad did two tours as a DI. Yeah, they're, 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 those guys are funny. They say shit that you're just like, where did that come from, dude? Like, what? How do you think? <laughs> what about kind of logic that? do you think you had there, numb nuts? <laughs> oh my god, dude! I'll never. I, we were in a, we had females on the base that I went to basic training at. We were still mm-hmm. segregated, but it was females. And I remember they came in our chow hole one time, and our drill sergeant yelled just out of nowhere, "Go stop looking at the lumpy soldiers!" I'm like, oh, <laughs> oh shit, dude. Man. I was like, this god is the funny. Bless, sh- god bless you. Sh- 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 <laughs> Nice. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> great, dude. So yeah. Uh, who do you think is a better hang? Uh, like a better group hang? Oh, group hang. Yeah, so you're yeah. with so soldiers. Group of comics. Group of comics. Mm. There's soldiers. It depends. Comics until they get depressed and yeah. then get sad because then it's like hanging when out. When are they with, not? Well, it's like hanging out with a drama club. Oh, okay. Okay. you know what I'm saying? It's just like, oh, <laughs> yeah. Shit. Look at this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That was yeah. a theater guy, too, man. I got it. <laughs> I'm going to do Les Mis Robins. Soldiers are going to try to fuck or fight something. That's the thing. Like, and when I say soldier, I mean military people. They're going to try to either fight you or fuck you. And yeah. that's like all they're got to help you if you're in a bar full of military people and there's like two chicks. His last call. Oh. Two chicks left. <laughs> yeah. Because then it's like everybody, look at me. There's like, it's nothing but oh, it's peacocks like the and shit ooh, ooh, everywhere. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Dude, it's crazy. <laughs> Go to, sheep <laughs> go to go to a bar outside Fort Bragg and just watch the sausage fly. <laughs> so Hot dogs fun. down the hallway. Fort, you said Fort Bragg. Okay. <laughs> sausages fly. I'm sorry, Fort, I'm sorry. Fort Liberty now. <laughs> okay, gotcha. <laughs> Oh, what they change on? They changed it. Yeah, oh, it's wow. one of those. They changed all of it. Oh, I didn't know Bragg was a Confederate name until they told me. I was like, oh, oh shit, I yeah. didn't know. There's no reason to brag about yeah, it. But, dude, they hated it. <laughs> um, I did a show so down rad. there. I was like, oh, I guess you guys are Liberty now. They were like, they started booing. They were so mad. <laughs> <laughs> shit. I was like, fuck, sorry. Let's out, we'll rise well, again. Just kidding, yeah. man. Liberty <laughs> is just way too PC. We you live in dude. Yeah, it's it's like, at least do another name or something. Well, and that was like that was like a thing. That was like one of the camps in Iraq where all the pogues. Lived, you okay. know, it's like, come on, dude, yeah. name this something 
it's bases that are named after people. People, that's what mm-hmm. you do, man. Be yeah, like, war heroes like from the South, right? <laughs> <laughs> Robert E. Lee, right, guys? <laughs> that's not a base anymore. Either. <laughs> yeah. 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 That lasted like three point five years. You know? That was <laughs> a high that? school. That was a high school right up the road. <laughs> yeah, fixing, right. They're fixing to make the other one. Stonewall again. They're like, oh, they're like making it go back. Yeah. To Stonewall. Yeah. From oh, Trin- the Unity Reed is going back. <laughs> like, yeah, we're not woke anymore. We're sleeping. Yeah, no, they're like, nah, well, we, but. I mean, he's still on the 20. Why should we change, you know? <laughs> we're like, we're still, we're woke, but that, this private donor has a lot of money. And, uh, <laughs> they own he's the spending land. a lot, spending a lot of Jacksons. Yeah, he's yeah. spending a lot of Jacksons. Anyway. Yeah. You got one? Um, yeah, I got one. Uh, who do you think it makes a better roommate, a comic or uh, someone in the Military all day, yeah. all fucking day, yeah. dude. I hate I living quiet. with other comics. Yeah, that was dude. really fast, yeah. dude. No, it's fucking true. Cause no, cause like, we're used to living with other people, so we kind of it's military is kind of like prison, you know. Like we know how shit's supposed to yeah. go. And it's like this is the right way. Got a system shit. time, yeah. or this is shit you do and you don't do, right, dude. Yeah. Comics that have never lived with anybody else except for like their parents. Oh, no, I moved, um, I moved back some years ago. I used to be in Alexandria. <laughs> I was doing good up there, then I didn't do good anymore. <laughs> Flew then, too close to the sun. And then I did some crypto. Um, <laughs> no, it, it was, it, but but we, we like, we know how to do that, you know? It's like, yeah, we're pretty okay. used to it. Com- to comics it. don't, like, and the comics sometimes are, are just oblivious to what normal shit is. Oh, they don't have sure. real Because yeah, they're that artist yeah. mentality. Of like, yeah. oh, no, I should just. Yeah, I'll just leave my shit here. I'll do. Yeah, it's just right. different, man. You're an artist who just wrote a dick joke. Okay, yeah. cool. I got mean, it. Cool. That's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm an artist. Let me talk about. Yeah, right. Uh, I have another one. Uh, yes. Who do you, who would you say is better at handling their alcohol? Man, shout out Felipe. Yeah. <laughs> shout out Felipe. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's, he's good until a few hours yeah. later, man. Like, it's when he gets that bottle of wine in him. Yeah, the, yeah. better. Not, you know, I'm not even talking about drinking. Man, this one you can go through the services with that. Thing, right? <laughs> okay, all right. Marines yeah. are the worst for sure because yeah, they're they're the definitely gonna try to fight or fuck. Mm-hmm. Uh, Army's probably second worst. Okay, uh, then you got. Uh, in, what do we have left? Navy. Oh, Navy Force. people are terrible. Oh, yeah? Navy people are terrible. Oh, Read a fucking book, man. Those people go overseas. They <laughs> fucking tear up countries, dude. They go down Well, because they're stuck on the ship. Yeah, and for yeah. Some, oh, they get that yeah. liberty pass. And they, they land and like, pass, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they go wild. Let's man. fucking go. Um, I'm coming back with VD. So maybe that, yeah. I don't know. Air Force people, they don't. They're, they're, the Air Force people are more like, hell, let's have a glass of wine. Yeah. Let's do a wine taste. Yeah. A little soft. I love yeah. it. You can really taste the tannins. They're smelling shit and stuff like that. It's what is this? Military guys. I, <laughs> I don't think Takante is familiar with like the hierarchy of uh, like the armed forces. Oh, yeah, 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 I know there's like, I've heard like the derogatory terms like Marines is crayon eaters, yeah, Air yeah. Force, Chair Force. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Chair Force, okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I know a little bit, yeah. Yeah, I know a little yeah. bit. He I don't knows, know. He knows some platitudes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I've never heard anything for Army or, uh, well, I guess you got Space Force now. Oh, uh, that's yeah. not real. That's just not real. That's not. <laughs> Okay, I'll tell you this. I, I didn't Colonel think it was really real. No, it's funny, though, dude, because I did shows on a Space Force base like a year ago, and it was funny because we pulled up. It was like, oh, shit, this is real. Yeah, I gotta, this is, yeah we I know a colonel. Yeah. I got to write new jokes. Yeah, yeah we man, know a colonel of the Space no, Force. No, two. Yeah, yeah. My, uh, my ex's mom was a colonel. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah, okay. Space Force? Yeah. yeah. Oh, we have yeah. two colonels There's a regular Space Force. at Bungalows. We know Colonel, Chuck. Uh, Chuck's in the Space Force. Oh, is Chuck in the Space Force? I wonder know. what they're going to do when, like, a high-ranking one dies and they put him in Arlington. What do, they, do they do a flyover or do they do, like, a rocket? <laughs> right, yeah. And yeah, 21, uh, 21 guns, they pew, pew. They do, yeah, they just had, they just had lasers. <laughs> 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 I don't know potentially, potentially. Yeah, who knows? Yeah, like Their laser. gravestones look yeah. like Han Solo. Like, uh, whatever, I don't know. <laughs> uh, moist night. <laughs> so All right, you took it uh, further than I could have oh, gone with it. I didn't know what that was. My bad. I was like, I don't know, is it plastic? So let's, let's wrap this segment here with this question okay. here. Um, it's a two-parter. Who's more likely to go home with a 10? And then who's more likely to bag a 2? Oh, man. Comics are more likely to be- go home with a 10. Honestly. Because, no, because chicks find funny dudes attractive. I don't know why, but they do. And, uh, yeah, I mean. It's because their eyes are closed when they're laughing. And the thing is, like, military people, like, you know, they'll be like, all right, man, let's. <laughs> Steal the deal. It's getting it's late. Let's, yeah. let's go. You know what I mean? Where's just the like, biggest Gorda around? Yeah. Yeah. Now, now, it will be more frequent with the military people. They will, but the comics have better potential of hooking up with hotties. Yeah, that's what I will say. Right, that's what I will need to start writing more jokes. Unless you're nowhere, <laughs> unless you're military, nowhere near military base, and then it's on. Oh, yeah. that's that's okay. that's when when you're when there's nobody so around that's military, and they're like, "Oh, you you must be a 
amazing. Like, you bet I am. <laughs> yeah, I'm a hero. <laughs> yeah. <a> goddamn hero. <laughs> yeah, I served in Vietnam. <laughs> <laughs> You're 24. <laughs> it was uh, it was crazy out there, Hamburger Hill and all that. You know, <laughs> the fuck? I watched that movie too. What'd you do in the middle? Of, as a, I just I swept floors. And stuff. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, I was special. You're not doing the question. Who did Jesus more? Who, who needs, needs Jesus, Jesus more? <laughs> well, so, so I was gonna ask. Although we we got an out at six, you want to just like keep going with this segment, and we'll just break up part two with this segment. I don't care so. what. You okay, do. cool. Well, we have an out. The outs in like nine minutes for you, so we want to make sure. Um, oh no, I don't need to go. Oh nice. Pull up uh, your favorites. I mean, go ahead. You brought it up. Who needs Jesus more, the armed forces or the unarmed comedians? Dude, all of them, man. It is, it is equal across the board because they're degenerates in different ways. Okay. It's just a different type of degeneration. I don't know if that's the right way to say that. but It's, it's like, funny because when I bring up being a pastor's kid to other comics, they're like, what the fuck? And then when I bring it up. I didn't know you were a pastor's people, kid. Yo, yeah. I was a yeah. pastor's grandson. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, all right, yeah. I'm better than you. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, we're we're going to I shouldn't say my church. I'm going to bleep that out. Uh, yeah, 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 right up, right up Lorton Road, baby. Come check us out. Come check us out. I hate mail, brother. <laughs> yeah, we, yeah, we don't have fans. We have haters. Like, um, we, we, we have one guy. No, come who, sit who on the front row, please. Yeah. That way, an altar the call, people, you have yeah. less room to go. Yeah. We, we have one comic. Not even comic. We have one uh, fan of the show who does nothing, but he's created four different accounts, one for my dad, my mom, my sister, and my sister's dog, and just leaves the most hateful, hateful comments. He's like, you're such an embarrassment, like, as my dad, you're such an embarrassment, son, I can't wait till you fucking get out, we should have fucking aborted you, and I'm like, this is a friend of mine, this is someone who, like, knows me <laughs> personally, out, yeah, so, you know, if that's you, please stop. Keep doing it. <laughs> Keep it up. I got some ideas, man. Hit me up. Yeah. 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 Hit me up. Follow, follow his YouTube do what, page. And, do whatever you, know, you need to do. He'll See, start writing for you. Trying to get Isaac some Jesus. And, uh, he's like, if he, if he, <laughs> maybe. He's like, if I if I if I make him have a mental breakdown. Oh, yeah. Add it. Add it to the. I got the rubber socks. <laughs> he'll come to small Don't group. <laughs> Wednesday nights. Small groups on Wednesdays. <laughs> yep. Yeah. We have small group at the Palm on Wednesdays too. It's oh fine. yeah. It's it is a type yeah. of small group. It is kind of. I think someone made a great joke about that two weeks ago. It was Pat. I was like, fuck, it is in small groups. Jesus. It was on it stage. Is. Yeah. It is. Yeah. Go ahead. Uh, I'm not sure if we asked this one. Uh, who would you rather be at a dive bar with? Marine. A dive bar? Oh, military for military sure. Military. Sure. Yeah, because if I get in a fight, yeah. I don't want to rely on a comic. <laughs> yeah. hey man, I make know. a really good witness. Yeah, yeah. See, yeah, might see. I, I'm so descriptive. I'm like, yo, six foot four, blue eyes, round see. ass. See. But see, that's the problem. <laughs> We need we need you to not be descriptive. We're oh. like, I see nothing. Oh shit! <laughs> That's okay. what we need you to do. Oh. What are you talking about? We're gonna like see it. I ain't never met Dwayne. <laughs> is that who's that? Dwayne's a black guy. guy. <laughs> <laughs> That would be great if cops were looking for me, like, hey, man, we're looking for Dwayne White. Like, shit ain't what, me. Like the hey, me too. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. Me. <laughs> the only Dwaynes I know, like, in person are white dudes. Really? It's, really? But it's a black name to me. I grew yeah. up oh, thinking it's a black yeah. name. Yeah. But the only ones I actually met in real life are white dudes. Yeah. Midwest, it's a Like, I know, dude. like, little Wayne. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dwayne, but that's it. Yeah, Wayne Brothers. It, yes, man. That's the, they're, the they're Wayans, the those are last names. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, I Sometimes, thought he said the Waynes. Yeah. No, you know what I'm saying? The, 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 the Waynes. <laughs> For you to cancel. Uh, wrap it up here, Nick, with God one more question here before we get dude. to the last segment. Uh, who do you think is better at hiding their alcoholism? <laughs> <laughs> Military people with the yeah. security clearance. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We're yeah. very good. <laughs> what do you? How often do you drink? Oh shit! I have maybe a beer a month. You know, you're <laughs> like, I mean, if like, that, you know, if yeah. that. You know. And I love it. Then they would ask all your friends on the security question: Have you ever seen him drunk? And we all know. You just go, no, I've no. never. I didn't. Uh, you know what? Steve? I've never. Had, no, I've what? never seen Isaac drink before. I, he That's drinks. Crazy. That's crazy. I know. Like, oh yeah, you know, he did have a glass of wine at that the Fourth of July. <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't shotgunning white claws in my backyard. It was, it was yeah. Memorial Day. <laughs> oh, what were you guys doing? Oh, he was fucking a hooker, but other than that, but, he, but he wasn't drunk. He was not, he was not drunk. He was not drunk. <laughs> so Using good. condoms. Used condoms, too. Ridiculous. Got they were from, used condoms. Free from the clinic. <laughs> Inside out, for my pleasure. Ribbed. Oh, my God. Got them from the barbershop. That was fun. I forgot. They used to give us condoms on the weekends. Be like, 
go, come pick up a bunch of. There'd be a big ass bowl. Of Here's your Liberty Pass. Like, Here's your condoms. There's this Man. local barber uh, that used to do that. Uh, Military his, grade. That used to have a bowl condoms. of condoms <laughs> sitting in the barber shop. Like, hey, I'd rather have y'all be safe out there. And yeah. take, they had them on the news no, and shit. See, that's that's, awesome, that's great advertising for him because he's like, yo, I cut your hair so good, you better go fuck. So <laughs> get a condom. Go get a condom. Like you leaving my shop, you getting some sniz. Please, like his name was take, Walt. take a condom, come back. Yeah, you know, Walt, he had yeah. a fucking uh, moped. <laughs> And he wore a Kangol. Yeah. And he gave up. <laughs> yeah, That's either the coolest dude best I know or the a vest. Ever. Sometimes we wear a vest. I'm giving away condoms for Halloween this year. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put that shit in. Like, Dad, I got a balloon. <laughs> no, buddy, no. <laughs> that might get you arrested and put on a crazy, oh, on a little silly list they put people on. The silly list. Yeah, the silly list. They'll list. never know whose house it was. <laughs> As long as they don't see this podcast. Yeah, until, yeah. <laughs> until you put your logo on it, D-Wayne White Coffee. <laughs> All right, That's, Jesus. We're looking for a black guy. <laughs> <laughs> he, he's between four foot eight I'll and six foot nine. I'll never get caught, man. Oh, I'll never get caught. That's, That's great. That's a perfect alibi. <laughs> All right, everybody. Perfect alibi. That's going to be it for us on part one here. I hope you had a good fucking time. Like and subscribe. Please check out all of his socials. It's White Dwayne, D. Wayne White. Any iteration of that, he's all over. Uh, Facebook, super active on Facebook. If you follow me, you've definitely seen his post. I share everything. Nick shares everything. DeConte does not give a fuck. Um, so okay. please, <laughs> check us out for part two where we do our favorite game, Bar Enemy, Bar Friend, and we find out whether or not we actually think he's an ally or adversary to the bar. See you guys. This is where she goes. Hello. Put it just a little bit. Did I fuck up the time? No, no, no. You're great. No. Yeah. Uh, uh, we're at like 20, 20 seconds. Rounds. Let me see if I can grab a salt. Oh, That's a fact. According to who? Yeah, he said, uh, shop in. His dad used to take over. Okay. You'd be willing to do it. I like it. We tried to like highlight a drink for every episode as okay. we know the bar girls. But you're not gonna do